So just a real quick review, or not even review, just a look at this Walla Mart um, 1500 watt hub and the, the whole kit. Um, <clears throat> this is just, we whipped it together just now. And I think this is the minimum needed to get it to run, just the smoke tested. Obviously this is, you know, not a permanent install. This is just thrown together as quick as we could to get it out and see if we could test drive it. Um, the hub went on very easily, you know, one washer on each side and then the lock washers in there. We did not use um, the torque bars in there. And then coming out of the hub, is a cable that comes out and it has uh, two sets of wires in there. One is five wires for the sensor that goes into the controller. Then there's the um, three wires uh, for the brushless motor uh, right off the bat. If you do connect those wrong, it's not gonna run. We were playing around with it like an RC car and switched it around to see if we could power it in reverse and the hub just kind of clunks some chains in there. So just color those or, uh, you know, attach those in their color coordinated fashion. I was kind of bummed, you know, I think these wires to the motor should be a little heavier gauge. Um, they've even got nice, you know, heavy gauge wire coming out of the controller. Um, next thing is the throttle comes down. What's that got four or five wires there connected in. And then, um, we bought this UPP battery. It's 52 volt. Uh, a 20 amp hour battery. I think what it is is just a bunch of 18 650 cells all wired together in there. Um, and then again, it's temporary. So just got some wire nuts on there to connect up the battery. Um, that's it. Throttle, battery. I think that is enough to get this thing going. So we're going to test it out and uh, go take a little run.